Hing a dink a durgan. What's up, Bozgirls Leaf? We're back with another quick update. Just gonna go through a couple of figures that I recently finished. Talk about some stuff that I'm currently working on. And if you are a subscriber, you pretty much know the deal. Okay, so last time I said I was working on my Eggman. Oh, there we go. Eggman's done. Sculpted in gray stuff. Everything's painted and varnished. Done. Now, one of the first things I sculpted in gray stuff was this. Choo Choo. From Top Cat. Uh... I sculpted it, didn't think much about it at the time because I was still working on clay stuff, so yeah, just set that aside. Um, you can kind of tell by the ugly wrinkles here and there. Uh, it was looking pretty shitty, but I just decided to paint it anyway, just see how it turns out. And I'm pretty happy with it overall. Maybe I need to add some whiskers for him, I don't know. But the Top Cat project is not dead. Not at all. Uh, I still gotta sculpt Top Cat, and after I've done him, we'll see if I want to continue doing it. Because it's pretty annoying sculpting entire heads. It really is. I recently finished up painting everything in a day for my new Vash. You know, I made an entire waist piece and everything for him, so it's just face and sculpt. And then I just gotta put a top coat to dull out the uh, gloss on every Lego piece, pretty much. That's it. So there's that, and here's something really unexpected. I started sculpting Hades from Hercules. This makes Hercules. Um, yeah. Just really liked the character and was making him in for anticipation of Kingdom Hearts 3, which I have played and recently finished. Um, definitely the weakest out of all three of them. That's all I can say. The mainline games, at least. I haven't played any of the spin off ones, so I have to get to that at some point. And of course, it ends with another cliffhanger because. Nomura, stick to character designs, please. Didn't know how I was gonna make this guy at first, but yeah, I just took a gray head and just started sculpting. That's it. Uh, video coming soon, explaining pretty much everything. I'm gonna show everything with, about this guy, you know, how he's made and whatnot. Also, I'm currently working on Senra Kagura stuff. Um, two characters so far, Asuka and Homura. Homura is about 50% done. Uh, Asuka, I'm gonna hold off on her because uh, I gotta get some more flesh parts. Since the Homura, I had the pieces for the uh, darker flesh tone for her. Uh, don't have that much left for the uh, light ones, so I'm gonna have to order some more. Uh, order more katanas because I need some katanas for my katana maiden ones. I need one for my Ryo Hayabusa one. I need uh, for Asuka and Homura, so I gotta get some more katanas as well. So that's kind of annoying making characters in bulk that has the same kind of weapon. Anyway, figures I'm gonna shoot soon. Devil May Cry 5, Nero, Dante, and we got Tsunimiku right there. Uh, I'm gonna try to shoot these two close to the release. So expect the video of this one come out sooner before these two. I also decided to make B. I looked up some gameplay with him, and I'm pretty sold on the guy. Uh, seems pretty cool. The character, at least. I don't know if the gameplay is actually that fun, but... From what I saw, it seems pretty good. So that's gonna be another annoying figure to make, you know, with all the tattoos and everything. Anyway, some new stuff. Um, updated stuff. These figures are just updated, okay? Um, first off, Blackrock Shooter. I gave her a new sculpt, painting the silver parts on her jacket now, uh, filled in that star which isn't really a star. I really should just switch out the coat but I just didn't feel like it this time. Maybe next time. Uh, changed the arms, I repainted the arms, you know, the lines were really ugly before. Filled in the star on the back as well. Uh, completely new sculpt. I wasn't happy with her tails back here at all, the ones I sculpted in stuff. but the front piece is still fine, so that's the same old, same old. So that's also another video you can expect very soon. Biome, Sora, okay? Sora from Kingdom Hearts 3. I'm thinking about making it from 1 and 2 as well, just because. Because I think all versions of Sora basically have some kind of appeal to them, so yeah. Like, this is a kind of a tie between the second one, because the, the second one's a little bit too messy at some points. But, yeah, it's overall kind of simplistic. I kind of messed up the colorings with the grays, you know, the dark gray and light gray on the hands, but it's fine, I just wanted to get the figure done. Overall, I'm very happy with it. Um, sculpt is in green stuff. One of the first things I sculpted in green stuff as well. Yes, green stuff. Kind of surprised how well it turned out when I actually used it the first time, but after that just didn't work, uh, didn't like it. Uh, hoods fully sculpted in grey stuff, so yeah. Also currently sculpting a Keyblade for him, so I'm gonna try to make it as good as I possibly can, you know, I got the initial sculpting done, just need to figure out the um, connection between the uh, keychain, that's pretty much it. 
And the last thing I got to show here is um, a Ria Hayabusa. And this time, this time, I decided to make him in his Ninja Gaiden 1 to 2 outfit. Just because I got the uh, silver now, or metal, whatever you want to call it. I kind of like threes a little bit more, but I guess uh, for customizing, this is uh, was way more fun and just uh, looks better overall. Because otherwise, it's just going to be a bunch of lines. That's the problem with the third one. It's just a bunch of lines. That's all you got to do. Um, not going to paint anything on his back right here because I'm going to have, just like I did with my stain figure, he's going to have his katana on the back right here. I'm just waiting for the uh, sheath to dry up. So, yeah. That's when the uh, video is going to be shot once I got that done. So everything is complete with the figure. Same goes with Tawar, you know, I just want everything to be complete. I always try to have an accessory to go along with the figure. Uh, same, just like I got, you know, Red Queen and Rebellion this time. Uh, which gets destroyed. I just didn't want to make the uh, Sparta sword. I just didn't. I just didn't want to do that because it looks a lot like Soul Edge, so... Eh. I've done that once, I'm not doing that again. Decent showcase, I guess. I mean, you got to see some shit. 